one on one video. This one is, as you can see, though, with OG Dogi at first. Um, to be Time to work, you, soldiers. I'm a bit of an optic fan by myself, and I kind of really like Scumpy. Um, Scumpy basically taught me how to use this weapon, and I've basically been beasting people with it. But you're gonna see in this film, uh, this guy is obviously a fanboy of Optic, and I wanted to upload this just to show you the frustration that I had to endure in this one on one. See, the problem is with fanboys, they play the style, the as in they're not very good, so they don't rush about. And what you're gonna see is this guy actually takes me out quite a lot of times in the same places, but in mind, even though I should completely. So, he's got decent aim, I'll give him that. I'm not gonna take anything away from him, but at the same time, it's just completely and utterly playing a noob. As you can tell, uh, he's going for he's out of like small corners. He's trying to trip me into going to As you can see, I'm on 3 for 1 at the minute. Take him out there, get me ICU. ICU. Because obviously you regen your health faster. So if you get hit marker and you're one shot, you're going to regen that faster, and chances are he's not going to come running up behind you and just take you completely out there. This one I've been working on the sort of long accuracy area. I have been doing a few one on ones. As you can see, 5 for 2 at the minute. Do 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 Sorry, I'm kind of mumbling to myself that. That is basically <laughs> boredom showing guys because this game is one of the most boring games I have ever played in my life. Almost as boring as the other one that I uploaded where I basically had to sweat. Um, what I don't like doing in games is I really don't like camping. Sorry if the sound seems a bit out of sync, I can't actually tell while I'm watching it back. It does seem slightly out to be honest. Um, obviously I will get that fixed again, but yeah, it's pretty annoying with the Elgato. That's the one bad thing I will say about it, is the sound sync. Fixes out there and stuff like that, I've used these fixes, but it seems to keep reverting to doing it, to be honest with you. Um, but unfortunately, you can't ask one of the big YouTubers, because... They won't, they won't give you the time of day to help like a small YouTuber out, to be honest with you. You probably won't even get a reply from them if you said hi. <laughs> Quite literally. Okay, so we're getting into the gameplay now. As you can see me here, running about willy-nilly. Shouldn't really do this considering the guy's player style. And as you can see, hid in the bush yet again. <laughs> Ah, uh, you should have seen me at the moment, I was about ready to throw my controller to be honest because this was just completely frustrating. But then again, you're going to get games that are frustrating, you're going to get rush games. Um, I'm not expected mm, to be undefeated forever, but yeah, um, as soon as I get defeated, I'll take it on the chin, learn my lesson, uh, not only learn my lesson, but yeah. Um, that's exactly why I'm doing these one-on-ones, because I like a challenge, and yeah, basically that's it. Okay, so we're on 8 for 6 now, and you can see me, yet again, do not like to camp, running about willy-nilly, take him out there, get me ICU. ICU. Did something a little bit predictable there, didn't turn back on myself. Um, yeah, I am trolling the outskirts to be honest with you. I know this guy's gonna be camped somewhere, so yeah, as you can see, it pays, it pays off well though. And I get that same shot as I made before. One of the things in one on ones is if your opponent knows the spawn points, he's gonna know roughly what area you're coming from. Or is he going to be able to rush over and hear where you're coming from? I can hear a few ways this guy is coming, but he's also camping a hell of a lot, so... Yeah, it just makes it 
bit harder to be honest with you because I am having to check everywhere around me. And quite frankly, I'm lazy to do that. <laughs> Unless I was like completely competitive and just like then a proper goal like sweat. But just like beast it basically. You can see you got the hit marker there. Is he gonna come round there? No. He's working his way somewhere. And he is above. You can hear his footstep jump there. I'm trying to jump just to sort of lure him. As you can see, I just made that shot. And boom. That's one of the good things about you take a little shot. If the guy's not very good, what they're going to do is they're actually going to take the bait on it. And he did exactly that, as you could tell. Actually, my footsteps. And he does take me out there. And then, yeah, unfortunately, a bit of a bad spawn point to have, so he takes me out again. <coughs> I doubt I'm gonna beat a red dot uh, pre aim in there. And that same place, guys before where he was camping. That is why this match is frustrating. I bet you're wishing. Thank God I didn't play that match. I couldn't be arsed with that shit. And take him out again. This is literally not going to be the most enthusiastic uh, video that I have commented on. Basically because I was bored throughout it, but I thought I'd put it up just to show you guys because you've got to feel my pain on this one. You've got to feel my pain. I was so unbelievably annoyed. I was just, yeah, I was ready to go rage mode. I just felt like rage quitting this match, but no, no, I don't rage quit. So, um, yeah, I'm going to finish the match and hopefully get the Sweat, baby, sweat, disco inferno. Uh, what I end up doing here is making a big mistake. I didn't realise that my honey badger didn't have dead silence on. And yeah, that's going to make me an open target as soon as I get killed next. And then once I realise, once I've got it on, I change it up. Where's the guy? Oh, look, he's here. Hey, you camping little son of a bitch. And you can see the weapon he's suddenly got on now. He's got a gold entire this time. Where he has been using red dot throughout most of the time. He's got filled on there. You can see the outgun in there. He's trying to match my gun, basically. Does take Got the honey badger on, big mistake, big mistake, and I pay for that one, yeah. Okay, 16-14, so this one is a close game, uh, whereas with the other match that I've uploaded against SCO Beast, this one it just was not competitive, was not fun whatsoever, um, it's just camp galore. The one thing you will get in any game is you can't really complain because people are going to sit in corners. If you go for a camp strike and you've got someone doing this, it, it's pretty frustrating because, say, you know, like a random scenario you're on, 23 kills, you run through a door, there's a guy sat in the corner pre aiming. And as you can see here, ooh, look, he's lay on the ground and he still doesn't realise I'm here. What an absolute noob. Okay, so I'm in his position this time. I know he's coming there. I'm gonna take him out, get me ICU. ICU! Team 14. 
one more kill to go. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment. Uh, let me know what you think of this game. Uh, let me know what you think of the uh, Optic Gaming fanboy. And obviously the scoreline could be a lot more for me. But I would literally have to sweat my ass off. And honestly, if I did that, I'd just be stood still. Okay, guys.